My name is Lukardowski of WeAreChange.org, and I bring good news from the United States of America. Right now, because of you beautiful, amazing, courageous people coming out here every Monday in the hundreds, wait, wait, in the thousands, you people who come out here courageously, fearlessly, consistently, have inspired people in New York City to rally with you right now in solidarity. It's a beautiful and amazing feeling, and I fell into this by accident. I was here in Berlin about a month ago. I get an email say, from somebody random, because I'm traveling Europe, I'm looking for stories. Someone sent me an email saying, there's a couple thousand Berliners, there's a couple thousand Germans every week that meet Monday, and they go against the banking industry. They go against wars, they go against the mainstream media, and they go up against the Federal Reserve. Now when I saw this email, I got this email, I didn't know what to expect because I never even heard of you guys. I was like, yeah, right, please. I got a second email saying, Luke, Luke, you have to come out here Monday. And I'm like, are these guys just busting my balls? Like, are these guys for real? I got a third email and a fourth email and a fifth email telling me to come out here to meet all of you amazing people. And then, what I did is I looked up the mainstream media reports about you guys. And as soon as they were trashing you guys, as soon as they were talking bad about you guys, I knew you guys were for real. I knew you guys were legitimate because that's what you have to do. Now, we came out here, we made a YouTube video with all the people here, all you beautiful, amazing, unique individuals from all different genders, from sex, from race, from culture, all the different variety of people coming here together. We made a video about that, and it inspires people in Santa Monica, in Vancouver, in New York City, in all over the world right now. The United States and Canada are standing strong with you guys, but what message does that send? that sends a message that shooting a video camera is a lot more powerful than ever shooting a gun. Now I could stand up here and I could tell you about the problems. To me, there's two problems. And I could talk about them all day, but I won't. These two problems that we're facing are really the most important to me. And really, if we have a problem, it usually means that we have an opportunity. We have a chance to actually do something positive. Now my major focus is on the mainstream media. It's funny how you have to read the opposite of what the mainstream media says to get the truth. It's, obviously, they're lying in Iraq. They're lying in Palestine, in Israel, in Ukraine. They're lying about the war on terror. They're lying about you guys. But most importantly, what the mainstream media does is that they install fear, they show you death, they show you starvation, they feed your minds with negativity, they make you full of fear, and they make you feel like you're worthless. We at We Are Change, we know that's not the truth, and we do the complete opposite of that, mainly because it is only our acquiescence, it is only our acknowledgement, it is only us allowing them to do things, and being ignorant on issues that allows the people to get away with all the horrible deeds that they're doing in this world. Now, we're living in a time where one person, one voice, one single human being could speak truth to power and the whole world could, he could hear it. We need to take advantage of the situation and all get involved with becoming the media that we want to see in this world. Let's not complain about the media not doing their job. Let's go do their job better for them. <laughs> Now, that's one project I'm working on, and I hope to speak to all of you beautiful, amazing individuals here on the side when I'm done. The second thing is the banking industry. Obviously, you guys know it's a Ponzi scheme. Obviously, you know it's only backed by our belief. Only by our use is this fiat money actually valuable because we decide to use it. Now. We know that. 
You know that. Everybody here knows that. We know the banksters are criminals. They not only money launder to drug cartels, but they make the rich richer and the poor poor. It's socialism for the banksters and the rich and capitalism for everybody else, and we're getting screwed over. Now, you know that's the truth, right? Now, with this happening, us participating in their system, using their fiat money, going to them for loans, making them richer, paying them interest. Why are we doing that when we could create alternatives? We could create something totally different. And right now there's digital currencies called cryptocurrencies. And it's backed by the same thing that the US dollar is, use and trust. That's all it is. Now if we as individuals with our computers could become our own little Federal Reserve banking systems, we could create wealth that we believe in. And only backed by our belief and our usage can we actually use something and facilitate something that the banksters won't be able to control. They won't be able to put out loans because we could create a system where this digital currency is actually feeding into projects that are doing good for the community. And we keep the money within all of ourselves, not to the banksters, not taking loans out from them, because we know that they're criminal institutions that do nothing but steal from the poor and give to the rich. And I am sick of that happening, and we will change that here today. Now, my last message is two things. Be the media that you want to see in this world. I want to help facilitate that. We could have conversations over here if you're interested in doing that. My friend here also is going to be uh, taking your questions as well. If you have any interesting projects uh, that you have going on that you want funded through digital currencies, please come talk to me. I want to meet all of you guys. I want to communicate with all of you guys. What we have here is so strong. It's so powerful. It's a family. It is something that those people, the police, the government, the corporations, they never have. They have to pay people to be here. We are here on our own volition. We are here because we want to be here, and one of us is stronger than 10 of them because they have to have money and they have to be bought out just to stand out here. I want everybody to do one small thing. Take out your cell phone, right? And look to the person to the left or to the right of you. Share your email, your Facebook, your Twitter, your Instagram. You guys need to start to communicate with each other. We together as a family, we together communicating with each other, being there for each other, will eliminate the need of any corporation, of any government, of any bank. The solution is within you. The answer is here, right now, as we speak, because together, collectively, we are fearless, we are courageous, but most importantly, never forget that together, we are change. Thank you guys, brother. Danke Berlin, I love you. Thank you so much for having me. Thank you very much, Luke, New York City.